high school family this is miss sarah and it's earth day i'm outside i hope you get to go outside today too it's pretty nice and warm um, we're gonna do something really special so as you've seen all of our caterpillars are inside of their chrysalises that means they're in their cocoons and you know the next step in their life cycle hmm. so first they're an egg then a caterpillar then they're in their chrysalis what comes next you're right they're going to be a butterfly do you think there's enough space in this container for five butterflies i don't think so they wouldn't have any room to fly so i have this special net it says the butterfly garden wow and that allows them when they come out of their chrysalis to have some room to stretch their wings and practice flying so we're going to try to move them or transfer from the cup to the net. And this is a kind of like a little holding station. I put the cup in like this and then that lets the chrysalises hang and then the butterflies will be able to kind of crawl off. So this is gonna be a little tricky. I'm gonna take a deep breath because I have to open this cup carefully. I don't want the chrysalis to fall down. If it does, that's okay, but I'm gonna try to be really careful. And once I open it, then I'll be able to show you up close what the chrysalis look like. They're really cool. They're very kind of like colorful. Some of them have um, like kind of yellowy spots. I think they're really cool. Ooh, I'm being very careful. And you can see that there's some um, kind of some webby sort of stuff. I'm trying to think of what that's called. Um, what is it? <laughs> it's silk. Okay. Oh, that one's wiggling. <laughs> That one's wiggling. So that is silk and that's their food stuck in there. I'm not sure if I should, I think I should pull that off a little bit. So I'm gonna carefully pull that off. I don't wanna pull the chrysalis off. I'm gonna try to be very careful. Hmm. Maybe I'll just gently pull it. I'm getting some of it off. Maybe I should have brought scissors. Hmm. Almost. Okay. Do you see them? There's five chrysalises and they're very colorful. And the caterpillars are working on changing inside of there. Okay. So I think they produce that silk or make that silk when they're trying to kind of get ready. <gasps> Oops. <laughs> One fell down, but that is okay. I think I'm just going to put them in here and have it sit just like that. Why do they make the silk? You know, <laughs> I can cut that right <laughs> Okay, so they're sitting right in there. Can you see them? Wow, what do you notice about them? What colors do you see? And I did, this little guy did fall down, but that is okay. I'm just gonna put him somewhere really safe inside and he'll still be able to come out. So there they are and I'm gonna put them very carefully into this net so that they can have somewhere safe to go and then when they're um, when they're metamorphosizing into the butterflies and they can stretch their wings and they can fly I'm not sure the best way for me to get this chrysalis in there I think I'll just put it in with my hand I don't want to bother this little guy or scare him but if I put it in my hand maybe I can show you what it looks like. Hopefully it doesn't tickle. <gasps> oh, I see. He was stuck on the silk. Can you see? I'm going to see if I can separate that silk. No, probably not. So we'll just leave it. Yeah, and I'm going to put it in very carefully. Okay, so now we have our five chrysalis is in our net. I wonder how many days it will take before they become butterflies. So cool. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know if you have any questions. How many days do you think it will take for them to transform into butterflies? Have a good Earth Day. Hope you get outside. Bye!